Hey everybody, welcome back to XCOM. This is Operation Witch Dance. We need to neutralize a field commander. It's a difficult raid mission. You never really know what that means, truthfully. Everyone's definition is different. Uh, counter dark event, new construction. This is the second in the chain to counter that. Uh, we have three sit reps happening, comms jamming, uh, shoddy intel, and savage. And then we're taking out words, our medic, gentle, our marine, ace, our tech specialist, hexen, our infantry, Brother, our sapper, and our newest marksman, uh, Andro Dro. Andro Dro. Let's rock and roll, uh, shall we? Let's go. Sky Ranger deploy. Menace, ready to deploy. Okay, so instead of a log today, I want to share something with you guys uh, that was built by a community member, long-standing community member, Fleet Admiral J. Um, he's had uh, soldiers in campaigns before, does a lot of uh, roleplay writing, and over the past few campaigns started this databank. The web address is xcom-databank.games. This is not like a paid thing, he's just a community member that does this out of his own interest to learn coding and stuff, and it's kind of taken on this huge, like, it's very detailed, very in-depth, and very cool. So if you're interested in seeing stats about every soldier, mission types, uh, basically you name it, he's got it all. He watches the videos and like logs everything manually. It's pretty crazy and uh, it's really, really impressive. Uh, I'll try to remember to put a link down below, but if I don't, the address is xcom-databank.games. Check it out and uh, thanks for doing that. Fleet Admiral, that's very cool. Now this mission, so this is actually my second attempt at recording this because uh, we reached a bug in the, in the mission that would crash every single time. If you were to reload and trigger this certain pod, I'm not gonna spoil anything. It would just keep, it would just keep crashing. Um, I had some of our mod guys looking through the um, log files and stuff. We tried a few different uh, suggestions of ways to get around that and nothing seemed to work. So I'm hoping that just by relaunching the mission that we're clear. I don't want to spoil anything for the mission uh, of things we might see here, but I, I know what is probably going to spawn. I don't think that's going to change. So... Yeah, it's too bad. But that's the reason we don't run Iron Man because we would be totally borked right now. Uh, okay, the, the layout of the map is different. So that's already a good sign. So maybe maybe things will be uh, completely different than what we did before. I'm going to send Dro up here. Uh, he's got super concealment. I guess we don't need to send him up just yet, but... Let's move in this direction. We could also maybe send somebody out here, maybe? These look like they're going to join over in this section anyways uh gentle let's just get you going as far as you can ace go oh ace is gonna see something here what do we got chrysalid crawlers okay we got chrysalids now we have that sit rep for uh beast like the savage uh sit rep i believe it's called so something to keep in mind. And then we have our newest uh, sapper over here, Brother brother Falk Dorn, who we met last episode. One little chrysalid. How much damage could he do? Let's find out. It'll probably be more than two. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. I apologize. Okay. Dro. Rolling. Did he say drawing? That would actually be super sick if he did. Drawing. Pretend that he did. Uh, we're going to set up this brace here. Um, I do want to try and find the commander. Heading out. Because that's when the timer is going to start. I'll put... Um, I'll put Gentle over here. Ace. I'm going to maybe take up this way. If we get revealed, I'm okay with it. I'm fine with that, actually. Uh, brother. Man, your mobility is... T horrible, I guess we'll go with. 
let's maybe put you a little further up only because you've got that frost bomb so if if the commander starts running for an objective then okay we're gonna try and stop that Eyes on the prize, covering now. okay not the ideal place for you to go but and there's another one lovely I'm gonna try and scout this because we might be able to uh, to lead the target on it. This is not amazing. What's my weapon range? Plus three. All right. Well, he's pretty far away. I do feel like we should probably engage sooner rather than later. Hey, at that first shot, I was thinking not so good, but uh, much happier with that. Come on, gentle. Yeah, thank you. Good job. Um, I think just a reload there is fine. Now, this could definitely this could definitely trigger that chrysalid that we saw. And it is. He's far enough away. I'm not super concerned. We've started to see some chrysalids lately. Very interesting. Now, do we want to break concealment on Dro? That's that's a very good question. Which is why I asked it. 59% um, here. I mean, we can take this. I'm gonna... Oh, beautiful. I was gonna say, we can go through all of our options until, until Dro is uh, ready. But now, we're gonna try and get him moving while we're concealed. Still no eyes. Words go. Ace go. Hexen go. And uh, we'll, Gentle an will catch up one day. Are going to try and the general from the AO. Okay, so Don't three turns. On board that ship. Oh, God, now we're like super separated. Do I, should I bring her back through here? That's like the safer call, but there is actually an opening here too. And where's this? Okay. Okay, there's no cover here. There's half cover. Let's let's actually start with um, with Dro. See if we can find anything location. in this middle section on the way. Nothing. Okay, we do have some high ground. If we could get him, like, maybe even here, he would have vision straight through to the objective. That could be kind of nice. Uh, or I could line it up almost like this. Head it out. Oh, here we go. Oh, beautiful. Objective here. We've got the general. We have the general targeted. Now he's got three turns until this thing comes in. Uh, Will do. Let's start moving these guys. Now we still have all of this. So I don't think they're going to see her. At least not yet. So let's move her this way instead. Um, Ace. Seems doable. I think we'll take that. Hexen. Copy that. Move up in here. And then we'll Location keep these guys a little bit further behind. Got it covered. If they walk this way, I mean, worst case, they take one Overwatch. Well, oh, they're going right for it. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Now, if I move in, they're gonna they're gonna scatter, right? They are going to scatter. I feel like this is the shot I need to take. I feel like this is the shot we need to take. There is armor, though. Oh, maybe we use the cannon first. But, like, I don't have... I don't have the visual. I think I'm going to take this much as I don't really want to. <sighs> okay. Well, that makes me feel much better. He's going up top. Okay. I can work with that. I can work with that. Now, I don't have a full cover to utilize in here just yet. This trooper is definitely going to be a problem. 
because he's probably gonna gas us or something. Not a problem. Not a problem? No, I I'm thinking definitely problem. I mean, this is a this is a decent option too, and we just go for the kill instead of because we still have two turns for this. I'm thinking we do this actually. This is for you. Shred the armor. We have a frost for other scenarios. We take the fall. Uh, he's still going to have cover from this, isn't he? Okay. Could be worse. Well, that didn't work exactly how I would hope. <laughs> That's okay, though. I'm going to bring, uh, I'm going to bring Gentle up top here. I mean, combat protocol is pretty decent there. I could run and gun in here, but then we're likely to trigger another group. We're pretty likely. I would, I would, I would say there's definitely another pod somewhere. I don't know that we need to rush this so much. That said, too, I could run and gun him in there. If something happens, I could pull back. But then I do have these guys exposed here, too. So, yeah. That's a little interesting. Let's do this. I'm going to move wards in through this side. See if we trigger anything down here. Seems okay. All right. I'm going to I'm going to be a little aggressive here. I'm going to go for it. If we need to run him out, then I will. So far so good. No! <laughs> Damn it. All right. This was the group that was crashing us on the last mission. And I'm hoping that that doesn't happen here. So far so good. Okay. Okay. This is actually uh, not the worst thing in the world, but uh, it's unfortunate they were sitting right by this open window. So I've at least gotten past a point where I was crashing in the last time, so that's great. The problem is <laughs> this: the rest of this is less great. Come on, buddy. Oh, two gi gigantic crits Menace on the general. Menace one five, kill confirmed. Okay, now... now to we save Hexen. The the These guys are far enough away where I think only Words is in trouble. Oh, the honed edge here would just be amazing if I wasn't concerned about these guys coming and killing him. I think if I pull back this way... These guys likely get gassed, but I feel like then Dro could even drop. I think maybe we would aid protocol this group, because I think... Ugh, it's so close, but no. Thought maybe I could get both. Yeah, I don't know that I have a, a much better option. I could overwatch words, and I could bring Hex in, like... I, I want to be far away from that Stun Lancer for sure. And that Trooper could come out and just flank us if we're not careful here. Yeah. On my way. Let's do this. Now, the Overwatch isn't really going to accomplish much. I think I have to aid protocol Dro here. He's the weakest health, uh, half cover. You know what I could have done? Well, if I would have moved these guys in, then he, his grenade is what I'm worried about. So. Let's go, baby. It's a big run for you, I know. Huff and puff. Oh, this guy might actually get a swipe in here. It's not as far as I was thinking. Oh, boy. Duck. Okay, good, good, good. Stunny. Oh, my God. Oh! Okay. 
Now it's up to the trooper. He's surrounded. Okay, it's not bad. It's just a scratch. It's just a scratch. We can, we can, we can get out of this. I think. Seventy-three here versus point blank. I mean, if I just shuffled a little bit, then we have a flank. But it would be really nice to have, like, a zone suppression on all of these guys so she can take all these shots, so... Uh, what's my other option here? Hexen can get out and go for this kill at 100%. That's good. And then we have everybody else to deal with these guys. Okay, that works. Oh, we have the frost bomb still. Might as well. Hmm, hold on. <laughs> I should probably move. On my way. Just in case he decides to swipe here, since we're kind of weak. This is going to change my my uh, zone suppression, too, because these guys won't move. Wait, do you not freeze? Oh, yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Dro. I just need to try and make sure you don't get hit. Oh, actually, you only have seven health. We have some pretty good shots here, man. Okay, I'm gonna go for this. I feel like we're all close enough where we'll be able to take this guy down. Seven damage off the bat. Very nice. He's rolling very good damage here. Okay. Now we just need a little tap. A little tap, tap, tap a -roo. You know what? Let's just combat protocol this. Don't take any chances. Only four from the big gun. Wow. Um, they're frozen, so let's just overwatch this. I need two damage there. Who's my lowest damage? Where's my LMG or this little bad boy, the bullpup? Okay, there's a lot of loot in this pod too. This was the same as the mission where it crashed as well. This pod spawned in with all of this loot. Um, Covert Infiltration makes it so that you get three opportunities at loot per mission, I believe. And they just all spawned in this group. I don't know if Chrysalids can, can carry any or not. Sure thing. But I suppose the other two could have, the, the bio commander there. That's right. Did you see that one? Okay, so pretty easy mission, <laughs> minus the difficulties that I went through to solve the crash problem. But if anything ever happens like that, I will keep you guys informed. It, at the end of the day, I could have just not said anything anyways, and maybe that would just be preferred because it probably kind of takes you out of the enjoyment a little bit. But yeah, sorry about that. Okay, the words please, four damage, not bad. Uh, gentle, nine damage, ace, seven. Hexen, 20 damage, MVP on Hexen. Probably his first one. Close range heavy hitter and kill stealer. Uh, brother, 12 damage, 2 out of 2 on accuracy. Wanton destruction, most exposed, ain't got time to bleed. And Rylus, Dro, Andro, 20 damage dealt. Sneakiest and most assists. Very cool. Very cool. I'm very happy we could get through that. So, that was nice. How often? 
often we have counseled you, our loyal citizens, to harbor no sympathy for the dissident factions that hide within our walls. For in the end, they shall always betray you. 100% shot. <laughs> I'll take it. Yeah, yeah, speaker. We got it. I can't imagine the aliens are too happy about this one, Commander. Hey, promotion's almost across the board. Uh, Dorn out for a little bit. He got tickled there. Now, what do we want to do here? Um... Attacks with your primary weapon shred one point of armor. Unlike Shredder, the bonuses from Splinter Armor do not depend upon or change with the tech level of the weapon. Now, because we're carrying the cannon, would this be an additional point? I believe it would. Suppression abilities will now disorient targets when applied or will apply a 33% mobility penalty to any targets that are immune, which will persist until the next turn. So this would work against uh, robotics then. And the mobility penalty from pin him down is not removed after the target is shot or moves. Can be stacked. Oh, cannot be stacked with Disorient or multiple suppression. And just like Disorient, the mobility penalty from pin him down can stack with other effects such as poison. That's really nice. Um, Ever Vigilant is cool. So anytime that we have an ability that lets me do something after dashing seems really nice. Like on our... On Tyrant, I believe, we got the ability to do a full dash, and then he automatically uh, sets up his brace. Really good. Really good, actually. Um, I find this is usually only helpful once, maybe twice per mission. Hmm. Now, if I keep splinter armor and we switch her back to, like, a regular rifle, we still get that shredding, which is always beneficial. But this seems really good. I love using that suppression. I'm going to use it. Yep. The crowd control stuff seems to be working extremely well for us. Uh, fleet footed for shadow step going into emergency aid. Rapid deployment. I think we're going to take this. Ace now. So we got low profile. I think... I mean... Man. Maybe we take the overload on this one. Because extended single ra signal range is very good. Like it's, it's, so, it's so much more flexible. Maybe Overload is something we come back and get on our Tech Specialist with uh, with extra AP. Tech Specialist remains concealed while the squad breaks concealment using ABC protocols. No longer breaks their individual concealment. Gain a 20% reduction to their base detection radius, but each time Silent Motors prevents a soldier from losing concealment, a growing 20% detection radius penalty is applied. I think I'm going to stick with the extended one, but I also would come back and grab Overload later. And Hexen, breakthrough, gain one partial movement action, 50% mobility penalty refunded. After a turn ending melee attack, this penalty is reduced to 25% when triggered with a light weapon combat knife. Okay, so this is super helpful. Super helpful. Because there's a lot of situations I do want to send him in there with the sword. It's going to trigger on any attack, hit or miss, so long as the attack would normally end the turn. Mobility penalty does not stack and will be removed after moving. Deep Reserves, two mobility running gun is activated and reduce the cooldown. That's really nice just in and of itself. Because we're currently on a five turn cooldown. And Breaching Maneuver, gain one partial movement action point refunded after a turn ending attack on a stunned or disoriented target, which could combo nicely with that disorient thing that came up. But it's very specific. It's very specific. Why would I take that over this? Because this... Okay. So this could be any attack. I understand. Whereas this, you got to be melee. But you don't require the stun or disorientation. 
I think I'm going to take Breakthrough here. I'm happy with that. Illyrium Core Experimental Mag grants an ammo slot. Hey, cool. Got a bunch of meld, 20 intel, some corpses, biogeneral corpse, gas grenade. Hey, I'll take it. We are stronger by far when working together. Consider it counters. Oh, look at this. Unquestionable commander. Andro Steady Dame. Oh, I think he already had this. I think. You don't have plus... F oh, never mind. Plus five aiming cover. Man, our traits, we've been pretty lucky. I don't think we have a single negative. That one makes him throw farther. Uh, firefighter has an... Uh, knows how to put themselves out quick. Yeah, like these are all positive, even though this one says negative. Deal additional damage to sectoids. Okay, where are we at here? I've got uh, <laughs> a few days until people are back. It's not horrible, though. Uh, we're at force level 4. 29 out of 30 crew. Um, man. I really want to... I really want to take this. But... I, oh, I just realized. If we take this soldier... And we have Hero's Welcome, which is a new Templar. I just caught this. That's going to put us over. And if we're over that at all, all of our recovery times are increased pretty significantly. So, I think I'm going to I'm going to abort getting these uh special forces soldiers here or soldier, I should say. And we're going to do the supplies. Then we're going to go black market. I think Avenger I think that's our play course. here. I'm still kind of learning covert infiltration. I'm still trying to figure out you know what makes the most sense. I also want to say, don't we have another engineer coming back? Hold on a second. Uh, no. Okay. No. This includes... Oh, yeah. That's right. We just got them back. Okay. Cool. So, let's do black market. By the time this is done, uh, we might be able to just do the black site. And I think that that would make sense. Um, yeah. Yeah. Main conduct out here is 160 intel. It's not impossible. Um, we definitely want to build out that way. There's one pip on that. Five in the middle. One down here. So, yeah. We make contact this way. We'd have to go through here. Eastern US, then down through here, then across. It might make sense just to kind of keep conquering Europe from the from the east but yeah Avenger plotting new course God Commander the aliens continue to make That's making me Avatar nervous would I like to have main weapons we'll before fast. maybe maybe I would um, power relay in six. Okay. Hey! Covert action for a facility lead. Um, yes. Yes, definitely. Minor risk of ambush. There's no way for me to get around that. Uh, but these facility leads are crucial. I should also get, get our, uh, I should get into the Reapers soon, but... Uh, we're going to be capped out, so that's something we got to consider um, until we can get some Illyrium. We can't do that upgrade, but as soon as I, as soon as I can, I will. So, minor risk of an ambush here. Where are we at for dodge? You've got 13. Assault infantries could benefit from dodge nicely. Here's somebody at 14. Maybe I send Pierce. He's not super fast, though. That's a little concerning. But 
Those disguises, I guess, are gone. I think they're on our other mission. So I'll build two of these. Okay, so that gives him the extra mobility there. And I could give him a bullpup for even more mobility. I think that's the way to go. And then that helps him with his dodge, hopefully. And then we have a lot of people available here. I could send Danil. He's got Phantom. And is already pretty speedy. But I really wouldn't mind getting Danil out there with uh, trying out that different kind of sniper build. But I do think it's probably the safest one to bring. If we get an ambush, these guys can probably outrun it. 16 and 16. Go with civilian disguises. And we'll go vector rifle here for even more mobility. Holy smokes. Speedy! Speedy team. She's awesome. He's awesome. Good luck out there. Enjoy your disguises. Uh, we'll see you in 16 days, probably. All right. What are you selling? Another engineer. It's tempting, actually. We have a decent amount of intel. Here's another actionable lead. Now, uh, in terms of actionable leads, this is something that uh, we, you can only buy once, I believe, in the entire campaign. So I won't buy it yet, but we'll try to make sure that we always have 60 intel. Chrysalid autopsy. I don't think so. Chosen hunter info. That's not bad. Supplies, advanced perception seems nice. Conditioning seems nice. It's like a plus two health, plus 10 aim, I believe. Bipod, scopes, laser sight. Or Illyrium. Or Illyrium. Uh, maybe that's what I do, guys. Hold on. So... We're currently getting Illyrium from a place to way down here. Commander. This range That's going to take a while. Sounds like a great candidate for our next construction effort. That's going to take some time. So, tell you what. Let's do it. Market is open. Let's buy some Illyrium crystals. And then I can do that that upgrade. So we stay well within our, uh... <laughs> oh, I need one power. <laughs> I need one power, okay? I need one power, and then we can stay within our crew limits. That's coming in three days. All right, I will do that. So we're gonna have you join. Uh, what's sabotage? Reduce the avatar project progress, that's good. There's a potential for ambush here. I almost don't want to say it out loud. Templar's coming in. Um, then maybe I can go and start this to get our Reaper. Everybody's available, so this would, this would be a decent time. I do need one sergeant here. A moderate chance of soldier wound with no way around it. Um, who am I going to put in here? Of our sergeants, we have no duplicate classes. Oh, I have two tech specialists. I've got two. Um, both of them, both of their will is relatively the same. Uh, Ace is technically the better hacker. Claudius has more health. Um, Claudius has low profile and extended signal range. Same thing here. So all in all, they're pretty similar. Uh, Ace is definitely slower, though. Definitely slower. But Ace's aim is a bit better. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, what was this giving? Nothing. This will give dodge. Let's get somebody new, I think. Marksman with dodge, kind of wasted, in my opinion. Let's 
assault infantry. I'd like to have at least one assault infantry for missions if we can. Maybe I put it on words. His dodge is going to be really good. <laughs> I think we're going to put words in there. All right. Get going. Now, um, I think maybe we just do the Advent Black Sight now. I think that makes sense. Yeah, we have every soldier ready. There's definitely going to be something that we can't account for, right? Like, so I do have to plan to leave some people back here. Western United States. But I'm going to try not to delay these a super long time. This will help with our uh, avatar project progress also. Alrighty. So, uh, Tyrant's definitely going to join. Uh, treason. You're in. Libby. Hexen. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. 11 on 18 there. 18 on 40. Let's try and get some promotions. From our bottom group here. 67 AM on the on the squaddy Isabel Sponsler. We could offset that. Um, I probably can avoid giving Tyrant the um, the aim thing. It's two Marines is kind of cool. It's a lot of shooty shooty. Oh, look, your aim actually isn't that much different. Holy smokes. That's okay. We'll boost it this way. Let's go light machine gun here. I'm, I'm actually liking... I'm enjoying these cannon builds on these Marines. More so than I am the, the rifles. That might change if I can only afford certain upgrades and stuff, but... Go scattergun on you. I think you're fine with the assault rifle. We'll go old world. Medkits here. Frost bomb there. And Tyrant. Hmm. Not sure just yet. Weapon wise on you. This grants an ammo slot, which we don't have a use for, unfortunately. Expanded mag. We take the speed loader and the expanded mag, I think. Oh, wait, can I not? Nope, I can't. That's cool, right? Because they're both like uh, magazines. That's cool. Offense versus the same target. This could be good if we run into something big, right? And then he's just blasting away at something multiple times. Mm, yeah, that's fine. And actually, since you're more likely to hit by the numbers, you can take the extra ammo slot. Who's got mobility issues? 12, 11, 12, 14. Okay, you take the lightweight frame. Shotgun, we're going to give the critical hit damage and the reflex sight. I have another expanded mag there. You, we're going to go scattergun. I think we'll give that extra ammo capacity here. And then you can take a suppressor. That's fine. 
none of these will work on the shotgun. And that's it, I think. Hold on. Yeah. That'll be about it. Okay, now we have vests as well. So, yeah. Um, what is this supposed to be? Oh, the ammo type. Okay. Interesting. Why are we having this here? Oh, oh, this is the wrong thing that I put on her. That's why. Doi. Yeah, okay. I didn't need to put that on her. I think instead of a grenade, I'm going to give you a nanoscale vest. I think I'll give you a mind shield. Nanoscale. Nanoscale. We do have a we do have a gas grenade. If we want to give that to somebody. I think this needs to stay. I'll tell you what. Let's switch his up with a gas grenade. And you're also going to be in front-ish. So take a med kit. All right, I think that's good. Tyrant Treason, Libby, Hex, and Cuttlefish, Izzy. A uh, little bit of a shorter mission today, but lots to do in the Geoscape. Black Sight tomorrow, so we'll probably do this as a premiere. So stay tuned for that. It'll be scheduled for the regular time. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And reminder, check out that uh, XCOM-databank.games that was made by Fleet Admiral J. Uh, really happy that you've put that together and you've done an amazing job. So go and check it out and give them some feedback. Take care, everybody. Bye for now.